Hello and welcome back to another episode of Rich Slowly Talk. Today we're going to be answering another customer question. This question comes from a customer wondering, how would I add another charge controller to my system if I wanted to expand? To simulate the solution for this question, we have one Alpha One battery, two 60 amp charge controllers, and two DC power supplies. These DC power supplies are used to simulate a solar array for this demonstration. Right now, we currently have our system set up in the way that the customer believed would be the solution to this question. We have our batteries connected to both of the controllers, and both of the controllers connected to a single solar array. All right, so now we're gonna turn on the power supply and see what happens to our controllers. As you can see, the wattage is fluctuating between your controllers. The reason why the wattage is fluctuating in this way is because these controllers are not programmed to only take partial power. So in a sense, they're fighting for all the power when wired like this. So the solution is to split the solar array so that the controllers are able to receive full power. So now, let's show you how to correctly wire up the system. So now we have our second controller hooked up to the second array and our first controller hooked up to the first one. So let's turn that on and see how it affects our controllers. As you can see, now both controllers are working in tandem together and they're only fluctuating periodically amongst themselves as they normally would. This diagram shows how to wire two separate solar arrays into your two different controllers and then into your battery. There you have it. I hope that answers your question on how to add additional charge controllers to your system when you want to upgrade. And if you have any other questions, don't hesitate to call or email us and have a solar day.